everybody, it is me Alice, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing the Soap and Glory collection because this video has been very very highly requested on my channel and I thought that would be the perfect time to film it because it has just been Christmas and um, Boxing Day as well and obviously I have got a lot of Soap and Glory for Christmas and in the sales as well. So I thought that I would show you guys because my collection is absolutely huge and I absolutely am obsessed. Um, so yeah, but without further ado, let's go on the video. Here, I store all my soap and glory in this huge copper basket. I'm not even joking. Um, this isn't all of my soap and glory stuff, by the way. I have more. And before we get into this video, in no way am I trying to brag or boast about my soap and glory collection. Obviously, I have been gifted and bought all of this with my own money. So yeah, but I do love to collect soap and glory and I do love everything in their like collection and scents and everything so yeah but starting off in my basket i firstly have a scrub of, of your life so this is the 200 ml um i use this for like fake tan and this smells of the clean on me i do have quite a lot of these i have got um quite a few of the minis obviously i'm going to try and find them um i do have quite a lot of the minis and i've also got the full size and these are excellent for scrubbing off like fake tan and just exfoliate in like your legs, your body, everywhere really. So I do love Scrub Your Life and obviously it smells of clean on me which is the classic soap and glory scent. So I do love these and I'm all stocked up for the rest of the year with these. I then have a lot of the body sprays. So this one is the Miss You Madly one. I don't think I've ever sprayed this one. I don't know if I've got this in the set at Christmas. I smell it. Mmm. And uh, this it smells kind of fruity and it's a really nice scent. Then I also have um, a mini of the Sugar Crush. I have used it before and this smells amazing. And then have a full size of the Fruitigal one. And I have a full size of, of the original pink. So the original pink scent is basically just clean on me. And I also have another of the original pink. I'm all stocked up with the, with the original pink. I've also got another mini of the original pink. I wonder what this will be. This is the Smoothie Star one. I don't think I've ever smelled the Smoothie Star, but the Smoothie Star is a lovely scent. Honestly, I, I don't know where to put any of these. Like, my hands are full. I then have two full-sized Clean On Me's. Literally, must have about five of these in the house altogether. These are the best things to use, and they also last a long time as well. So this is the... Oh, uh, this is... Uh, this is 500ml of the Clean On Me. This scent is amazing. Um, the original Silver Glow scent is my favourite, I've got to say. And this lasts forever. And the pump is really good on it as well. And it's really good um, for cleaning your body. And um, you always smell nice after using this. So I do love this. I think I've only got two of these. But honestly, these last like for ages. And they are the best shower gels you can ever get. I do love them. I then have the Wonder Woman um, bath bomb. And this is a uh, really cool like the colours and like the style of it is really cool but it's in a set um at christmas time so i do love this it's really cool and i'll be able to use this in my bath speaking of the bath bombs i do have three others here so i basically have the fizzle ball ones so i basically have a sugar crush one and two of the original pink honestly these are so cute and um i think I've, I've had these for a year i don't think i've ever used them but i will have to use them because they will smell really nice. I make my bath all nice and nice smelling. But yeah, they are actually really cute as well. Look at them, they're really nice. I have a Glow Forth um, Original Pink um, Body Shimmer Dry Oil. But I think you can just use this all over your body. I've not used this yet. Um, I wonder what it's like. Is it, is it like a spray? Um, it's uh, one of them ones uh, that you pour out. Uh, that's quite cool that and this smells of the original pink as well which i think is really cool and the color of this is beautiful as well can't even get the lid on what am i doing but yeah it's really cool and the packaging's really nice as well i then have some um, body butters so i have a smooth star mini i've got uh the righteous butter mini i've got a sugar crush mini which i've not actually used yet oh good catch yeah i have a sugar crush sugar crush mini i also have another Oh, the righteous butter mini i literally have uh, loads of these um and body butters i also have the uh um, the butter be good one um which was a uh, last year's scent it was like a spicy one it was, it's really nice actually and then have um two of the medium size uh, righteous butters as well wow i do have a lot and then 
And down there I also have a full sized uh, mattress butter and another medium sized. So I do have quite a lot of these. But yeah, I, I love these. And these are really good for like after shaving your legs. Um, because, it, because firstly it makes your legs really smooth. Secondly it makes your legs smell unreal. These are the best uh, body butters to go for. It's a Superwoman one and this is the other full size one as well. And these are absolutely huge. I'll just open to show you it. But, oh, that looks so perfect. Oh, like perfectly whipped. Oh my god, look how lovely that is. I don't know if it'll show on the camera. But, oh wow, that looks and smells amazing. <laughs> they are my faves, honestly. I then have a 300ml of the One Dishner Intensive Conditioning Hair Mask. So it's basically like a conditioning hair mask for your hair. This smells of the original pink scent again and it looks really nice. I can't use this on my hair. It will be perfect if you use a lot of heat on your hair. It will be perfect to make your hair all nice and smooth and soft again. So I can't wait to use this. I have the Vitamin C first Facial Wash and this is the Super Fruit Peach Smelling one. So I've got a full size and a mini and this first wash is the best if you've got oily skin. It smells real and it's also really good and uh, makes your skin all nice and smooth and clean and it smells unreal as well so this is the first wash to go for if you have oily skin and you want to get rid of your spots it does work like a dream and it's so good i then also have a hand food however this one is in a pump i got it in set at christmas time and i do also have like a normal hand food and uh, they usually sell these like this you have to squeeze it out but um, this one um, will be really good if you're at home you just want to use a pump so this is the two hand foods and these smell of the original pink and I love these. I literally have about five of these in my room, no word of a lie. I just love using them. I also have one in a sugar crush scent as well which smells unreal. But yeah, these are the best hand creams, especially at Christmas time. They make your hands all nice and smooth and soft and it's amazing. I then also have this Pulp Friction um, Body Scrub. Uh, this one is a mini one. I don't think I've ever used it before. But it smells quite nice. Smells really nice actually. I also have a mini of the Sugar Crush Shower Gel which I've used half of and this Sugar Crush scent. Oh, it's like a dream. It smells unreal. Like it just smells of like zesty kind of like, I don't really know how to explain it but it's like zesty kind of like uh, lemon and lime kind of scent. It's so nice. And I have a full size of the Heal Genius. So this is actually really good. I've only got a tiny bit of this left and I've used this on my heels especially if they've been cracked or really dry and this works on like it's amazing like it works so well on your heels and this is the best heel cream I've ever used Um, it's so good just it just works like a dream so good and then also have a mini of the sugar crush spray and I also have another of the sugar crush um, body butters I've got a load of the body, of the body butters but I just love to collect them and then I also have the Total Drama Clean Magnetic Micellar Makeup Remover and this is like um, a declog kind of water so it's bit, uh, basically like a micellar cleansing water but this is good for kind of oily skin and well um, kind of for all skin types I suppose it's got cucumber and peach fruit in it which is really cool and the packaging of this is really nice as well so hopefully it'll work alright on my skin I haven't tried this yet but I'm hoping it'll be okay and then I also have a, a, another makeup remover. I have used this a few times. I don't know if I like this to be honest. Even though Soap and Glory is an amazing brand, I'm not keen on this. This is the Peaches and Clean Deep Cleansing Milk, and I've had this for like two years. Like to take off my makeup, have it. it makes my skin really greasy after it, and um, it also goes in my eye and really like stings my eye. But um, if you do have dry like dry skin, it'll probably work on dry skin. But no, I'm, I'm not keen on it. But if it does smell nice, it smells of peaches, so it kind of is good, but at the same time, it just isn't nice on my skin. Moving on to face masks, I do have a lot of face masks. So the face mask which I've got is a Radiance Boosting Mask. This has got um, vitamin C in it. And I also have a Puffy Eye Attack, and I've used these before, and these are um, really good for if you're really tired, or if your under eyes are like um, really dark, it um, makes them really bright, and it honestly is works like a dream. But then I also have a pore refining mask. This is really good for like oily skin that I've got in combination and I think I might have used this before and this worked really well. Um, so hopefully it'll be um, 
a really good again when I use it. And then finally, I have um, a declog mask, uh, and this basically has like um, curling. It's got clear powder. It's got uh, vitamin C. It's got like everything in here, and basically, I um, squeeze these in the mask. I think, and it should work. So, yeah, I can't wait to use this. I also have off your face. Um, cleansing wipes. I don't think I've ever used these before but they do look really good and hopefully they will smell like the original pink scent because I do love that scent. It's amazing. Then I also have the Fab Port Moisture Lotion um, and basically a moisturiser and this um, will be really good for my oily skin. I also have a Superwoman pink soap which is based in the shape of a star and it, like, it has the shape of the woman in there looks really cool and it even has a little handle on it which I think is so uh, useful for hanging it up like on like a window or something or like on a little like hook or something in the sh in the bathroom so then finally moving on to makeup I have the super cat eyeliner I've had this in the past and this is really good eyeliner um, um it's a, a, amazing for creating winged eyeliner I also have uh, the figure fast mascara which I do love this mascara and it is a really really good mascara for making your lashes like voluminous. Then also have a sexy mother pucker in rose and shine. Also have another one in candy queen. Also have another one in bare enough. And then I also have a spectacular lips um, in the shade plums up. So yeah, but soap and glory lip glosses, right? The sexy mother pucker range. They are the best ever. If you have not tried them, you need to get them. Um, especially in the one, Rose and Shine and Bare Enough, because these two are the ones to go for when choosing your Sexy Mother Pucker lip glosses. They are amazing. Uh, they make your lips look plump and they also look really nice on top of liquid lipsticks as well. So yeah, they are very beautiful. That is everything in my Soap and Glory collection. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. And if you've never tried Soap and Glory, make sure to head over to Boots or the Soap and Glory website and get your hands on some amazing um, products. Also, uh, there is a Boxing Day sales on, so you can also have a look if they have any left. And if they do, please go and buy Soap and Glory because it's amazing and I am obsessed with it. Like literally, I've been collecting it for the past three years now and I have uh, never been disappointed ever so please buy some if you can but anyway um, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to leave a thumbs up and a comment down below and please also subscribe to my channel as well because we are gaining so fast I'm honestly so grateful for everyone who has been supporting me over the past few months honestly you guys are amazing and I will um, try and sub subscribe to you guys back and also follow you guys on instagram so make sure to leave your instagrams down below and i will go and follow them but i'll see you in the next video bye guys